Hello guys, I'd like to show you the booting time, my old iBook G4, and this is the MacBook White 2009. So this one, uh, made from uh, 2000. This MacBook is a 2005 MacBook. Uh, I mean iBook. Uh, this last generation of the iBook G4 and this is the new generation of uh, white MacBook so uh, there is a big difference between them so I will show you the putting time of them so I installed this one with the uh, original Mac OS Tiger and this is with the let, uh, not latest version this is the Leopard 10.5.6 Okay, I'll show you and I'll give you some information about the specification of the both of this Apple product letter. Okay, I will put and I have no stopwatch or, or, or something like that so you can count by the second in the bottom column of this video. Okay, let's start. One, two, three. Okay, let's see. The right side gives the sound and I just turn it the sound off in my iBook G4. And the left side, you know, uh, almost similar time showing the Apple logo. And I set already to be the fair post mode, so I can now the uh, I can easily know the what is the wrong detection of my Apple my iBook G4. But I have no set. I have no fair post mode in the right side. Okay, so this is finish and not. In a different, not in a differences in a time of putting, right? So just after the right side, I mean the i the MacBook, turn it on and ready to ready to work. Followed by the left side, so it means the differences in time may be around ten seconds. So. You can imagine this is the 2005, this is 2009. Oh, okay, so I, I use a team fever, so okay, omit it. So you can imagine this is old and this is a new one, there is no differences. And uh, last time ago, I also tried to install the iBook G4 with the Leopard. So finally the booting time is a little bit slow and I also cannot uh, do my work fastly because sometimes they give me long time to wait until the program open completely. Okay, I will show you the specification here. Okay, let's go there. In the about this Mac. Okay, wait for a minute. Okay, this is more uh, okay. So, as we can see here, this is Mac OS, the lat latest version of a uh, Tiger 10411, and this one, the I the processor, the latest processor is 1.33 gigahertz Power PC G4, and the memory is 1.5 gigabyte. So this memory is uh, maximum memory capacity, I think. Okay, see, so, uh, I put a maximum memory and the hard disk is about uh, 40 gigabyte. So this is the original hard disk. I have never changed the hard disk into the new one because it is very difficult for me to change the hard disk in this uh, iBooks. If I change this hard disk, so mm, I have to open all of this 
cover this is side uh, I don't know this is too stupid for me okay let's see in the right side mm -hmm. okay yeah let's go to see about this Mac I'm so sorry what is that uh, here uh, this is the not let us uh, actually now right now the OS version Tiger uh, I mean the Leopard is 10.5.7 but I have uh, uh, installed yet later I'll install and this is the you, you see a uh, little bit blur so 2 giga where is the cursor uh, okay it is very difficult to shoot while <laughs> while changing the cursor position 2 gigahertz Intel Core 2 Duo and 2 gigabyte of 667 megahertz memory of RAM so this one uh, originally what is that originally hard disk capacity is 120 gigabyte so let's of the putting time and the specification between the two of this uh, Apple product uh, Macintosh computer so I have a plan to buy, to, buy, to sell this one but I don't know the price uh, but I still love it in, in the, this iBook G4 because uh, since the first time I we I used this one, there there was no problem, and the battery is also so impressed because I still can use this without the energy, without the cable from electricity. I mean, run from the battery for three hours. You can imagine three hours, uh, and this one because the new one. So I tried last time mm -hmm. the working hour of this MacBook is around five hours. So I think it is because of the new one. But this one is very good condition of battery. Okay, see you next time. Thank you for watching. Bye bye.